Hi there, my name's Mike and uh, I'm also known as uh, Grumpy Paladin on Twitch and also in Fortnite and um, some of my followers on my channel have asked me how do I end up getting so many resources uh, so this is a video, a quick video just to show you how to get all the resources you ever need from the game quite easily uh, also along the lines of getting perks and you can also get schematics and other resources as well that you wouldn't want to get so anyway to get into it this is what I do this is how I do it first off I have to pick the right kind of hero so what I've got is I've got uh, a master grenadier you need someone like a soldier someone who's good at close at arms also very good with health and uh, can hold their own so I've got the uh, master grenadier and I've got her uh, added with um, uh, personally I've used the cloak star because he gives me uh, a regenerate energy 24% more quicker and also I've got good old Wukong uh, who's changed my shockwave not back into something that's got an enemy stun with it uh, so right to get into the game itself let me uh, just come out of this one and uh, this is what you do what you want to do is go to the map actually before you go to the map make sure you're on private mode unless you want somebody else to join in and steal all your goodies uh, go to the level that you want to do I'm going to be doing it in twine and what you're looking for is the desert area now the reason you're looking for the desert area is because you don't want too many buildings and you want to be able to see uh, where you're going and uh, get to the areas you want to okay so I'm gonna go for this one here it doesn't matter what the time is uh, the only one that you want to stay away from stay away from should I say is the uh, evacuate the shelter because straight away you've got to go in there uh, defend the shelter and then you only got 10 minutes so you want some you can pick any of the others doesn't really matter uh, so I'm gonna go for the savior one uh, survival ones now the reason I've gone for this particular one is because one it's in the desert and two there's not a lot of buildings if you see you've got buildings on all these believe it or not these little pictures do make a difference to what kind of map you get so I'm going to select that one and go straight into the game and what you're looking for primarily are chests okay so it could be a case of getting the uh, high level chests where you can get things such as uh, perks or getting um, schematics or it could even be um, storm chests where you can get weapons or it could be um, uh, super stashes as well uh, where you just get basic stuff it could be a bit of um, weaponry, it could be a bit of um, resource so that's what you're doing but you're doing it in a quick way so you're looking for mountains and you're looking for mines hence why we're going to the, uh, the desert because they're easier to find uh, what I normally do is I normally go uh, to big chest in other words like a storm chest or um, a main chest and um, then I just uh, come out of the game and repeat rinse and repeat go back in keep doing it that way so this will show you how easy it is so here she is she started off I literally hug towards the edge you'll get used to this after a while uh, where the mines are so you keep your eye out for mines you can get you can guess where they are by looking out there's one there straight away so we we'll pop over <coughs> break in and go down and loot along the way now normally I would loot everything I could get my hands on but I'm just going to do it quick and easy this time around so I'm not going to be going for the metals or anything like that so it sounds easy I know but that's literally what it is but you're doing it in a speed kind of way also it means you can watch the TV like I do normally when I'm doing this um, because you get so used to it you can literally go in go out bang done move on to the next one right make sure you check behind here um, I'll show you there's nothing here at the moment but sometimes you do get some oh, here he comes look hello boy pick those up go for as quick as you want really it's up to you um, normally I would take my time a little bit more around here but as you can see there's a dirty great safe <laughs> Thank you. 
So that would count as one. One of the main ones. Keep your eye out for anything. So you're looking at a minimum of two of those kind of chests. Um, well, not those kind of chests, but two main chests. So like I said, it could be a storm chest, could be one of those saves, could be a big chest, could be a, a super stash. And out we go. So what was that? Minute and a half, possibly. Go to the next one. You also want to make sure you cover the corners. Okay. The reason for that is that is where you get a storm chest. You get most of the time, nine times out of ten, you get a storm chest out on the edges here, on the uh, when you do the actual desserts check this little nook here sometimes you get a chest just inside there or you get uh, some more there don't worry about the hordes just leave them alone uh, if anything and they're still following you when you come towards the storm chest it all adds up to the count so all good here you go storm chest so I'm gonna wait and see if they come over to me here they come. Let's start. Cube is your destiny. Kuala's victory. Get over! Cube is your destiny. Kuala's victory. Now you could stop there, but I'm going to carry on. Okay. Sometimes you do actually get more than one um, storm chest on these levels. Oh, this is not going to be fun. Oh, we got past the bees. Good. Uh, it's up to you if you want to do the um, if you want to do the encampment side. Don't bother with them. Can't be bothered. Have a quick look up here in case there's another another one up here. No, no mine there. There should be one just down the road here though, somewhere. <clears throat> also keeping your eye on the on the actual um, on the mountains as well, because we're going to do one in a second, just to see what's up here. Yep, yeah, do these as well. Do the shadow orbs. If anything, you get some loot off of them, but also sometimes they do stick them quite close to a mine. No, nope, not one here at the moment. That's fine. Let's go. Oh, here he is. Go and have a look on the mountain. No, they don't break them. There you go. Chest number three. Have him. Also look on the sides just in case. Sometimes you do find the chest put on the sides. Also gives you a chance to have a good look around as well. Like I said, I'd probably actually quit it there and I'd probably go and do a rinse and repeat, go back in and go back in and go back in, but I'm gonna carry on. Uh, don't bother with the bunkers, you won't get much in there. Yeah, you can loot them, but you won't get anything um, fantastic in there. i give them a miss, just due to speed. If you've got time on your hands, go for it if you want to. There's another mine there. Over here. Are. Let's 
run past them all. They're going to follow you anyway. If you're using a commando like I am, you should just kill them all together. There. Silly me. Right, another chest. Might be a mimic. Grab them if you can. No, we're okay. Don't know if they're following, but it looks like they were. Anything down here you can look without actually getting in there? No, nothing worth doing. Move on. Quick check over here just in case. No, nothing there. It's really worth having a look though. You'd be surprised what you're going to find in the mines. And like I said, you can literally do this while you're watching the TV or something after a while. Um, I would have, yeah, I definitely would have um, actually stopped after about two or three of those, uh, two or three of those chests, but let's carry on. So there's another mine here. Also check the flat roofs just in case there's a mine underneath the buildings check behind the corner nothing okay now this might look like there's nothing here but you can break through to this other side see what's in here nothing but you never know Let's go back to the mine. Pretty certain there was a mine there. Let's have a look. There he is. Depending on how deep this mine is, I might call it a day on this particular map. Check behind there. Giving up today. Go on, die you. Also, make sure that the map you've gone to doesn't have any of the uh, the husks doing any horrible clouds as well. You'll be able to see that if there's a purple cloud on the um, on the map itself. If you can get away with it, don't do them. Watch out for any uh, any husks that have got the the gas bottles with them. They've got a tendency of blowing up the. Um, the chess, which is not really cricket, is it? Check behind here, sometimes you got one. Have a look down, see if there's anybody there already. No. Nope. Another safe, grab him. Have a look, sometimes you get a chest down there. Look around the side, nothing. Okay, move up. Don't forget, always having a look on the walls because you might see some stuff that you, you want. If you can, definitely do the um, toolboxes. This is one that some people do miss sometimes. All right, nothing in there. Okay, what I would normally do then, and I'm gonna do it, is I'm gonna call it a day that one. So we're gonna leave the mission, have a quick look. Right, round two. Same again, I'm just going to do this second one just in case there's any differences that I can point out to you. Uh, just have a quick look, make sure there's no nothing down there. Sometimes you do get them there. Right, there's a mountain, or what I call a mountain anyway. So I'm going to pop up there quick. Let's 
And look, you've got two chests. Don't forget to look on the sides, just in case you would be surprised, seriously, what they hide on the sides. No, okay. Have a look across. I'm going to take the quick and easy route. It's up to you. And voila. This time we've got evolution materials. Check the sides. Might grab that while I'm here. Right, I'm going to go down from here. And I'll just go around the edges. This is where she's really handy. Right, check with Dino in case he's got one hidden in his, uh, his mud pit. Sometimes he does. Check the map, make sure that um, you haven't missed any storm chests. You can check over if you want, down here, there's another one. So what you do is you break through, it's alright we're going to come back up again. Break through, here's a, here's a safe. Go back up. Right, check to the side. Sometimes you get a chest in here. Make sure you keep an eye over there. Sometimes you get stuff in there as well. Okay, so we're coming out of here. Right, let's go back onto the map. You really do need a, a good, good um, soldier, I think. Personally, that's what I'd go with. If you want to do Outlander, it's fine, but I find that you don't get enough um, health with, it, with an Outlander. Um, so what you gain with um, getting more stuff, um, you could get pretty frustrated by not getting, um, by getting killed quite a bit, shall I say. Keep your eye open. Don't bother with the uh, survivors. Good luck to them. Check the flat tops. Also inside, sometimes you get safes in there. Right now I'd be actually talking to the wife and saying, yeah, I'd love enough cup of tea or, yeah, yeah, I'm having fun. If you've got one of these lakes, check in the middle. And if you see any of those um, dinosaurs that they stick out, check underneath their legs as well, because they got do got a habit of um, putting chests there as well. <clears throat> ducks as well. If you come across ducks, kill them because then you can get your power cells. Right, get back on the road. See how much have we cleared. Ooh, look at him getting beaten up. Poor, poor bloke. There's a flat top again. No, nope, not so good this time. Have a quick look through. No, nope, poor man. Obviously, ain't, haven't got anything we want. all the time keeping a little bit of an eye out I mean even if you just go for the two chests go for those and rinse and repeat it's fine bunkers personally I wouldn't touch them entirely up to you I don't find there's anything in there we're after the chests I know you can get you can get resources but I wouldn't touch them right make sure you don't go too close to the edge how many times I've failed by not paying attention where the edge was, it, you could, well, 
Let's not go there. Right, bring out a turret or two. Smasher's not helping. There we go, got rid of him. Good. Got 20 seconds left. Brought the turrets out a little bit early, to be honest with you. There's the Miss Monsters done. So, one half of me be saying, right, rinse the repeat on this bit. But I'm going to quickly carry on. Up to you if you want to go down there. Personally, I wouldn't, like I said. But hey, yo, it's totally up to you. Sometimes you do get multiple um, storm chests on these, so. And looking at the map, I've nearly covered it. I'm just going to quickly go down the middle. There should be another, um, should be another mine just about here. There we go. So we should have covered most of the mines, if not all of them. Never make that jump. You could probably do it a bit more thoroughly than I am at the moment, if you really, really wanted to. Oh, I was sent it in there. Now then. Don't forget. Just in case. Didn't notice him. Get out of the way, shorty. Now I've yet to find anything interesting at the back of this one. If you get lucky, let me know, but I've yet to find anything worth you know bashing a hole through for. Go up here, see if there's any final chests, and then call it a day. No, no chest, but we'll grab this. Also a we'll check behind as well. All over here, just in case. No, nothing there. Right, okay, that's it. So we leave the mission and we're tight what we get. Now that took about say 12-15 minutes, maybe a bit earlier than that, um, depends how quick you want to do it. If you want to do a really quick rinse and repeat, like I said, just narrow it down to two uh, main chests and go that way. That's probably what I would be doing most of the time. So I've got eight of those, could be up, any up to 42 uh, rain, anything like that. So if I go into my armory now, what I did is I actually had it cleaned out of anything really worth, you know good uh, level or higher so we'll be able to tell what's what so let's get rid of these might be lucky might not be lucky all depends really so we didn't get a massive amount from that lot okay let's batch recycle these this is a little bit better okay and if you want to batch recycle these as well we'll use them up to you give them to newbies yeah, use them anything you want. Personally, I just get shot of them. So, what do we get in total? Might not be a lot, but we've got three of those, four of those, 39 of them, 31 of them, 7, 7, 28, 1, 7 of those, 27 of those. I don't know about you, but I can't stand pulverizing rocks, so it's a lot quicker. 11 of those, and it will build up bit by bit, and you get all these extras as well. Um, so it's entirely up to you. Uh, if you want to use that, mo that model, please do. Um, this is Mike, very grumpy paladin on Twitch or grumpy paladin in game. Signing off. Thank you for watching. Arriva Dirty. All the best. Love you lots. Love you, love you, love you big time. Bye bye. I tell you what. I need to have a pee. I'm sorry, guys. I'm letting the site down. I know.
But nature, nature calls, and I'm busting. I'll be back in a minute. Try, try not to kill me. Why am I bloody dead? <laughs> 